today I went to consult the doctor because I suffered severe stomachache. I suspect it's because of the purple tea I drank last night, which has been in the fridge for a long time. It might have gone rotten, and uh, I happened to drink it, and it caused inflammation in my stomach. Um, over from from last night to the afternoon today. I still feel really aching in my stomach, so I went to see the doctor today, and um, it is a really interesting experience in consultation. Um, the first thing, when I got in, I showed him which part that I found hurts, and um, by placing my hands over the stomach, and then he 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 voiced that. Oh, it's the upper part. I feel confused because um, it's it's the central part of my stomach. And then he used his finger to point to um, an area he thought it should be the belly button, but it's interest down below my belly button. Um, anyway, it's a bit um, interesting. Um, then he he just estimates the location wrongly, so. Anyway, the consultation goes on, and um, something strange happened. And he, in finding out the cause of my my stomach ache, um, he used a stethoscope to check whether it's unusual sound made by my nor made by my stomach. And then he found that none is normal. And. Um, also because I was having sore throats when um, simultaneously um, so then I he asked me a question really funny one he asked whether your throats hurt more or your stomach hurt more I said both I feel the same for both but then he denied it no there's no reason for that because your stomach is okay after I checked it with the stethoscope. Um, he was rejecting my description of my own feeling based on his findings with that equipment. I would feel that, wow, <laughs> he is ignoring the voices of the patient. Um, how come? <laughs> but then, um, another thing he he did is that um, when I told him about the herbal tea that I really s I strongly suspect is the cause of my sickness and that caused the inflammation he rejected it again he said that no because I hear no sound in your stomach you should not be having inflammation because if you have inflammation it must be some noises uh, like things like that oh I was so weird out again because um, he has a lot of presumptions in his mind and he is so occupied with his own judgment that he drives away the patient's words and their description uh, from the first hand um, experience um, so this is a whole consolation so from this experience I would say this doctor is really subjective he is ignoring uh, my my feelings and my description of my uh, my my feelings and I don't know what a good doctor is like, but I think you should be open to to hear what the patient said because they they know so much about how they feel or what they've done that may cause them sickness. But it seems that he is closing his ears all the time. He just hold on to the, his equipment or any presumption that come from nowhere or based on no facts and 
this is a um, really interesting consultation and I found that no matter which occupation you are in um, in interaction you should really try to take in the words of the other person and not to be subjective because in fact finding you you need to ask a lot of questions but you're gonna listen and pay attention to that or what is the meaning of asking questions um, so this is my my experience today thanks for watching